Hi, this is Andrea Towers with TV Insider in the Hollywood-branded Unbranded Lounge, and I am here with the cast and showrunner of Teen Wolf, the movie. Hey, That's hey. right. Guys. How's it going? Um, so, both Tylers, how does it feel to be stepping back into your roles after so long? Uh, incredible. This was always something that I had the most love for ever. Loved this show, loved these people so much. Missed it. The fans always talked about, like, let's bring it back, let's bring it back. And I was right there with them. I was always like, yes, let's sign a petition. Let's get all of us to go uh, uh, protest in front of MTV buildings. And I was just always down. So the fact that we could make it happen, uh, super grateful, thankful, happy. Yeah, it's the greatest ever. Yeah, I think we all, we knew the fans really wanted it, and uh, for us it was always something that was like such a great idea, and um, I think Tyler said it right. It's really, our group is a family. Uh, most of my like greatest friends are from this show, so uh, really lucky to be able to say that. So I think um, you always hope it'll happen, but um, a lot of times they never do, so we're, we're just glad that we got to do it, and back at Comic-Con. So. Yeah. Comic-Con itself was like our biggest thing that we looked yeah. forward to as a cast. We would take the train down, we would like party and hang out on the train, and just like, the second we got here, it was just like this endless vacation for us. And so the fact that we could be here again is another thing that's just like serendipitous and a landmark for us, and very happy to be back. Have you seen, like a lot of fans have fan, while you've been back here, or people, because people are really excited <laughs> to have you guys come back. Uh, yeah, you have some people in the hotel and everything. It's kind of, I mean, we just, we just got here, and I feel like they also just got here, but it's, right. uh, it's, it's off Did you have a, some encounters in the hotel? We had some selfies and, and whatnot. Already. Nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm at an Airbnb off location, so I haven't fully I'll been- I'll post it, the address in like two minutes. Yeah, please. <laughs> uh, been immersed into the fandom world yet, but uh, always it'll looking happen. forward to it. Don't worry, it'll happen. I'm hoping <laughs> so I need it to survive. Uh, Jeff, uh, reboots are kind of all the craze right now, um, but what made this the right time to jump back and bring the show back? The studio wanted it. <laughs> the petitions outside the yeah. MTV. Yeah, right? yeah. I, I wouldn't stop bugging him about it. I was, I was signing a petition to not do it. <laughs> but <laughs> no, it's um, it feels like home. So. Uh, it was always in the back of my mind. I always had a feeling it was going to come back. Um, and once I sat down, they, they actually said to me, do you want to write the script or do you want to hand it off to someone else? And I started thinking of ideas, and I'm like, I'm writing this. Nobody else is writing this. No. <laughs> so um, once I started getting into the characters again and deciding, OK, it's a new world for them. It's a jump in time. What are they like now? That's always fun to do, to see where are they now and to create a story off of that. Yeah. Well, speaking of that, um, I know there's a new Big Bad, but can you tease anything about what fans can expect to see? Oh my God, I don't know. A I'm big return wait. of a certain <laughs> character. Yeah. Yes. Maybe a few. Maybe a few. Maybe a few. Yeah. <laughs> big mm. returns. You're getting inside scoop here. <laughs> Scott McCall has a buzzed head. <laughs> it's the first time he's ever had short hair like this, and I'm very excited about it. Um, I know we're also getting uh, Papa Styles and Mama McCall back in the movie. Are they going to have fun stuff to do? Do they get to play along with you guys? <laughs> Hell yeah. One thing that Jeff Always. is great with, uh, amongst uh, most things, is that <laughs> he knows how to write every single character into the show and the movie and make their moments just big, powerful, epic moments. And so everybody who's a part of the show and the, mo the movie uh, has a just a beautiful moment. So M Papa Styles and Mama McCall are it's you know they're no different. He well, it goes he back leave to what out. you're saying about it being really a family cast and a whole family group of sure. people. Sure. Yeah. 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 We it's it's uh, it's so great. Uh, will there be a time jump? Yes. Oh huge. Yeah. 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 Are we allowed to say how much? And I can tell you when the movie takes place, and it's 2026. Right. <laughs> Why? I had right? to do a lot of figuring out. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot of math. The original series only takes place during a three year period, which seems kind of crazy to me for 100 episodes. What's cool is that I've never been the same age as my character ever. <laughs> he, was, he was 15 when I was 18, and now he's older than me. <laughs> so it's, it's awesome. It's really cool. Yes, he's older than me. He, he's older than me. <laughs> you never got to catch up with that. Never, no, no. I actually That's still don't know how old my character is. He's ageless. <laughs> he kinda He's is. a timeless beauty. <laughs> like, it's, yeah, it's, it's very kind of like, yeah. yeah. It's a wheelhouse. Know how old your son is. That we do know. Look at that. Yes, Ooh, do. spicy. Yes, yeah. hey. His son, he has a son in the movie, um, played by the 
incomparable Vince Mattis, and he plays Derek. Derek uh, is 15 year old son. 15 years old. Well, thank you guys so much. Uh, Teen Wolf, the movie, premieres on Paramount Plus, and thank you guys for being here. Thank you. Thank you very much for having us. 